Now to Commitment 2009, and Senator John Horn is the first candidate for mayor of Jackson to air a TV ad. 16 WAPT's Megan West put Horn's claim the mayor is asleep at the wheel to the truth test. Hello, City Hall! Somebody's in there driving this bus, and they're asleep at the wheel. Senator John Horn accuses Mayor Frank Melton of being asleep at the capital city's wheel in the first TV ad of the crowded race. Take a listen. Our city leadership has failed us. They failed us on crime, and they failed us on jobs. This city needs a new driver. I'm John Horn, and I'm here to apply for the job. A successful state senator, John Horn will do what other mayors have failed to do, bring real change to Jackson for all of us. Are you ready for a new direction? Mayor Frank Melton's camp is coming out swinging against the commercial. Campaign manager Eric Fleming said, quote, with $2 billion in economic development projects, which has created thousands of jobs, putting over 100 new police officers on the street to protect Jackson citizens and upgrading the city's bond rating in the middle of a recession, it's obvious Mayor Melton has not been asleep at the wheel. So let's take the economic development claims first. Downtown Jackson has boomed over the past four years, but the groundwork was laid for many projects projects like the convention complex years earlier and squabbles with developer David Watkins nearly squashed the King Edward renovation before it began. As far as law enforcement, there are new officers on the street. In fact, 24 new cops graduated just last month, but the city is still short. The 500 officers former police chief sheriff Malcolm McMillan said the department needed. In fact, McMillan resigned two weeks ago, saying he no longer supported Mayor Melton. Well, we can say the mayor's asleep at the wheel. Some of the achievements his office claims are not entirely his own. For the Truth Test, I'm Megan West.